Hello and welcome back to All About Community. Again, my name is Robert L. Harris and I am your host. When we went to break, I was speaking with the CEO of uh, Youth Uprising, uh, Ms. Burrell. Uh, what is this concept known as peer group sessions? You, what, what, what is that about? You remember when you were a teen? <laughs> a long time uh, ago. A little bit but ago. I still remember. Still remember how you were impacted by your peers. Yes. When we allow peer led conversations, meaning let them be in the front. Mm -hmm. Let them program, let them design their conversations. I was speaking with our communications associate at, at Youth Uprising, and I said, instead of us putting together the names of groups, whether it's around relationships or whatever, ask them, what are their top five or six areas that they talk about in the, in the bathrooms or, mm -hmm. you know, mm -hmm. in school? And let them come up. So the peer sessions are just that. These are youth that go into our living room space, 1,500 square feet of space, mm. and have peer-led interaction and conversations without, you know how sometimes you don't want the parent around, we're not in there. <laughs> we're allowing them to have these conversations. Well, that's good. And it is, now I'm always in the back sneaking, kind of looking in, you know. And when I listen to how they are so authentic, transparent, mm -hmm. excited, and it builds trust amongst them as well. So Talk, those are our peer sessions. Talking about building trust, uh, I know our time is running out, but I must touch on uh, public safety. Mm -hmm. How does this fit into this whole concept of youth uprising? We are constantly at the table or constantly making sure we're attending our neighborhood community meetings, making sure I'm always at council meetings to understand what is the public safety strategy. Youth Uprising is a safe space away from what could happen. So it is also that hub that youth gravitate to because they're not on the street. They're not at, at risk, I say at potential, but they're not in a space of opportunity where they may get hit or, or may get shot. So our Youth Uprising is a safe haven against the things that are happening with public safety right now that need a lot of work. Absolutely, yeah. it does. Yeah. And I understand that uh, you wanted to make uh, some I, final comments. Uh, final comments. I know time is running I, out. I, I am a it is just so excited I'm, to be here. I'm a, public, I'm a publicist by nature, so I brought you the Youth Uprising Signature Backpack Bag. And uh, this is for, for you to, to enjoy. And I just want to say thank you for having me. Youth Uprising wants to thank you. And all of our students who are going to be coming through, I want to say thank you for this opportunity. Well, you're quite welcome. And uh, I'm, uh, again, just delighted to uh, have you here. Uh, I think I was uh, around when Youth Uprising, I believe you indicated, was founded in uh, 2005 and uh, saw the uh, building uh, as it was being renovated. And uh, I always wanted to know what was going on there. And I've learned something over the years, and especially from you. Uh, but in your final analysis, give us your website and uh, how people can volunteer, which you've already indicated, and then any final comments you want to say. Absolutely. Our website is <laughs> www.youthuprising.org. On there, you will find all of our information. There's a contact link, and you can also fill out something there. I will say to you, we love community as we're in community. Thank you. All community are welcome. You do not have to be a youth or young adult between the ages of 14 and 24 to come. You can show up. We are happy to give tours. And just know that our youth are amazing. They are successful, they're brilliant, they are diverse, they're transparent. So when you come, be prepared <laughs> for a treat because you will get a treat. So thank you. And sure. most of all, they are resilient. They, they are never resilient. give up, they just keep on pushing. Yes. And I believe that was a song called Keep On Pushing by uh, Somebody. I can't remember. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, uh, it was by Curtis Mayfield. Keep okay. on pushing. Uh, 
Thank you very much for being my guest. Uh, unfortunately, we have run out of time. And uh, uh, <clears throat> no matter what you do, when you do it, or how you do it, in the final analysis, it is still going to be all about community. My name is Robert L. Harris. I am your host. And thank you, Ms. Burrell, for Youth Uprising thank and for your leadership. We really do appreciate you. Thank you very much for joining us.